this is Julie Reddington, a realtor in the Denver metro area. I have been doing a series of videos and today's topic is what's involved when you buy a short sale property and what you can expect. A short sale property is when a current homeowner can no longer keep up with the mortgage payments and has to short sell on the house. Now when a house is listed as a short sale and it goes on the market for the for the first time, um, what you can expect is that the actual bank who has the mortgage has the final say on what they want to sell the house at. So it's a bank approval. So when we write a contract, we will actually get the seller, the current homeowner, to, to sign the contract. But then it has to go into the bank. And, and this is where it can take some time. So a short sale is probably not a good idea if you're wanting to be in somewhere in a, in a shorter time frame. If you've prepared to kind of sit it out and wait, then this is a good option because we have no idea how long it will take for a bank to come back and for them to tell us what they want to sell the house at. So despite the fact that a buyer and a seller may have agreed a price, it's really down to the bank to decide what they want to sell the house at. And at that point as a buyer, if it's a figure you don't really like, then you can walk away from the deal. That's where you will see, uh, if it says bank, uh, sorry, short sale approved, it's already gone through that stage. The file's already gone to the bank. The bank have already decided and they've approved it at that price. Now, there's not really a lot of negotiation from that point. It's kind of what the bank is saying that this is what they want. And like I say, you have to choose then if you, if you want to go. But if it's a short sale that you're wanting and you want a quicker transaction, look out for that. It will normally have it in the MLS description to say that it's, it's short sale approved. And then from there, it would probably act like a normal contract. So um, that's just a brief outline of, of what's involved. Like I say, there is a certain time frame which is, is a lot long, uh, a lengthier process than it would be if it was just a regular seller or even a foreclosure. But short sales are still great deals to pick up as long as you can be patient and hope that um, everything goes through smoothly and then the bank don't foreclose on the property through that process, which is also something that can happen. Now, if you're interested in uh, buying a short sale property, look on my website and there's actually a section that features short sale uh, homes for sale in Denver. So my website again is juliereddingtonrealestate.com. Remember, you can reach me by phone, which is 720-226-4168. If you have any other questions about what's involved, in any type of uh, real estate transaction, give me a call. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.